Hey everybody, Xander here on December 27th, 08. It's four days till New Year's Eve, so Happy New Year to you all. I'm in uh, Boca Raton, Florida right now for uh, winter vacation. And I'm going to do another iPhone tutorial. Now this is going to require an I a jailbroken iPhone or iPod Touch. And the qu a question I've been getting is how do you access your iPhone's database? Or in other words, how do you SSH into your iPhone or iPod Touch? Well, it's really easy, and I could show you using uh, Chicken of the VNC right now. I have it open on my iPhone. So, there, there's one thing you're going to need to install in order to do this. You need to download OpenSSH. Now, quick, uh, quick shortcut to do this is through Featured Packages. It could take a while since it's time to turn the load. And scroll all the way down to the bottom where it says console utilities and daemons. I don't, I don't know what that is. And the last one with the little sun on it, just it says open SSH. You just click on it. It says open SSH, secure remote access between machines. Well, right now mine says modify because I have already installed it. But yours should say install and then confirm it. And after you installed it and if, if it says restart springboard, yeah, just do that. It's not, it doesn't take that long. And then go back to your home screen. And now the next thing you're going to want to download is an FTP or SFTP client for Mac or Windows, whatever you're using. So I already have one downloaded. It's called it's uh, Cyberduck, probably one of the best clients I ever I've ever used. And we're just gonna open that up. And Windows, I think you have uh, um, Qt FTP or something. I, I don't know. Just find find one that's freeware. Now that you have your Cyberduck window open, you click um, or or whatever you're using. You just op you um, open up a new connection, and then just leave it here for a second. We're gonna go back to the iPhone right now. Go to your settings. Uh, yeah, use Supreme Preferences. Big whoop. <laughs> you go to Wi-Fi. And then whatever network you're using, click that little arrow next to it, and take and, pl and take note of your IP address. Now, if you're going to be using SSH a lot, I would recommend putting your IP address on static. So now you have your IP address. Go to your go to your um, FTP window, and switch the protocol to SFTP, which is SSH File Transfer Protocol. And then remember that IP address. Type it in. Dot one dot one oh six. Leave the port number and for the username type group root and then the password be would be Alpine. Then press connect. And if it asks to um, uh, allow a key or deny a key, just press always if you're gonna be using this a lot. And here you go, you're into your iPhone or iPod touch. But I would I would recommend backing everything up if you're gonna replace um, some certain stuff since I know customize is broken for 2.1 or 2.2 and that's why everyone is still at 2.0 they're waiting for customize. All right, guys, um, I hope this was a useful tutorial on how to SSH into your iPhone or iPod Touch, and uh, have a happy 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 New Year. <laughs>